are out for a drive. And I figured since we were out this direction, uh, near K.I. Sawyer, which used to be an Air Force base, that we would drive through the old base. And we take you along. But it's raining and the wipers are going. We'll see how this goes. Okay, let's see. They've turned this into a uh, yeah, thorough uh, highway here. When it was an Air Force base, you had to be military to drive through it, but now. go back here very much. Let's go left. There's right down there. So if you were in the Air Force and lived on Sawyer, you will remember these homes. We had a friend that lived in one and we'd visit them. It looks a lot different here than it did when it was an Air Force base. houses look so tiny now but when we lived here they seemed huge compared to where the home I was in okay 
so these are duplexes which were also nice and I didn't live in a duplex but you only had one neighbor so your housing here was based on your rank and also the size of your family so don't want to antagonize the cop <laughs> let's go right uh, let's see yeah so housing was based on the size of your family and when Dutch and I lived here we had to get on a waiting list to get on the base and then when we did we didn't have any children <laughs> so we got a smaller unit to live in probably drive right past it and I'll show you there was a school K. I. Sawyer Elementary School to the right Looks like they're still using that school. That's interesting. I might as well go straight here. And I think all the street names were named after airplanes, uh, military planes. Like that Strato Cruiser and Air Cobra. Thunder Chief, Stratocruiser looped around there, Valkyrie, ah, oh, now that's new, Woodview Estates, Liberator, yeah, there were no privacy fences like that, not that I remember. Maybe they were there. They were probably there. What do I know? That was many, many years ago. <laughs> yeah, it looks a, a lot different. For one thing, stuff isn't maintained the way the military maintained it. Restricted on what you could have in your yard and all kinds of things. <laughs> okay, what street is this? Oh, the street sign's missing. Ah, uh, let's see. I'm Air trying Cobra. to remember. Huh? Air Cobra. Yeah, I'm trying to remember. Well, let's go right here. This is the road we came down, wasn't it? Or was it Savage? would have been nice and mowed, trees taken care of. Okay, slow down a little bit. We are on Stratofort, I believe. Let me double check. Oh, the sign's missing. So, Commando, yes, we're on Stratofort. Okay, slow down again. It's Real slow. Oh, is there a cop behind us? A car us? behind Oh, a car. Okay. All right, turn left just past this building here. Right here into this driveway. And hopefully they're not turning in here too. Nope, they went the other way. Okay, do you see this garage here? This first garage? That was our garage. <laughs> go ahead to the end 
and down here behind here is this big just stop here this big uh, valley here wow it looks so and there were the best blueberries growing down there wild blueberries anyway this is where I lived for two years it looks way different okay you can back out We had, yeah, you should back into one of these spots. There you go. Well, you're okay then. You can just pull forward into that one. This this end um, apartment had four bedrooms and we had three bedrooms and they were very tiny. So we were in the second left. Woo, we passed it already. <laughs> okay, so I lived in a multiplex like that for two years. It was really nice. Now I can tell you where we are, because this was the area I was familiar with. To the right here, that's where officers lived. My, um, the nurse midwife who wanted to deliver my baby lived down one of those. And I think these are just regular enlisted people again here. So there was kind of a mixture, huh? 25. I remember when I was in labor with my first kid, I came walking. I walked all down the street and around the church. I'm trying to walk. Huh. Okay, let's see. Slow down. Uh, does this go here? Yeah, take a right here. This is where I thought we were before. See, I told you it's been a long time. To the right. And then, um, right again all right this is where the officers lived back in here <laughs> and yes they're single family and duplexes and I think this is the this was where the back entrance to the which way ah uh, we're just gonna well, turn right. We'll find a spot to turn around. Now we are off the base. So, we are entering the back side of the base. And there used to be a guard shack here. It's gone now, of course. And this was a, a ski hill. They had a tow rope here. Or a sledding hill back there. Just looks so run down here. Single family homes Choice. left. So you had to be like the commander to live back here. <laughs> okay, so we have seen enough of the old housing area. You can see it was a military base based on the signs there. It's obvious, it just looks like it. Okay, this road also had one of those um, speed limit signs that changed. So if the weather was bad, they would lower the speed. <laughs> Gotta go.
the BX and the commissary there. You guys can, I'm recording it to get a little glimpse here. And the bank there. Okay, and the old planes on display here. We're gonna go straight. Look at their wild turkeys out there. Oh, my camera's not focusing. <laughs>